Wisconsin versus Troy J. Hoffman. Wearing a full-length protective suit, Troy Hoffman appeared in Racine County Court by video Monday. He is charged with shooting and killing his co-worker Chad Bickler and also trying to kill a woman prosecutors say was dating them both. The state believes that a very significant uh, cash bond is appropriate based on several factors. One is uh, obviously the premeditation behind this act. Prosecutors say Thursday night Hoffman went to Bickler's Wind Lake home in a jealous rage, angry that his girlfriend was seeing a new man. In court documents, the girlfriend told police Hoffman recently, quote, found out about her new romance. While she was on her way to his home that night, Hoffman texted her and said, quote, if she was going to see CAB, he was going to kill CAB, meaning Chad Bickler. When she got to the home, she says Hoffman rear-ended her car. They argued. She saw his gun and ran off, quote, fearing for her life and called 911. I heard a smash and then I heard multiple gunshots, so I hit the floor. As she walked back toward the home, the girlfriend said Hoffman fired at her. A family member told 12 News the victim's brother had run out for pizza and returned to find his brother bleeding to death on the kitchen floor. He got to hold his brother one last time and and tell him, you know, he loves him and gave him a kiss and, and then he faded away right in his arms. The brother was still too distraught to talk on camera, but gave 12 News these pictures of a candlelight vigil held in Chad's honor Sunday night. Hoffman is due back in court here next week. Meanwhile, the family is planning Chad's funeral for Saturday. In Racine County, I'm Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News. Bond was set for Hoffman at $750,000. He's also charged with shooting and killing the victim's dog.